Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. So, we are on software 10.69.25 FSD beta, uh, but also 44.25.5 on uh, the normal software. So, um, there's been a few uh, exciting things that I wanted to show about this build. One of the down parts about Tesla is that it's a very expensive vehicle, but we don't really have a 360 video camera so this is the backup camera and it shows backup camera is always anyways dirty for us over here and when in snow conditions we've got the left and right repeaters that uh, show the show the cars next to us so and then we've got the front facing camera which we can't really pull up over here unless uh, there's there's a way around it i'm not too sure um so one of the things that are exciting about this new build or the holiday update build is that if you if i hit the reverse over here and if you check out the screen on the left, if you check out the screen on the left, it wasn't working for some reason, but right now it's showing it. You can see the cars next to us, and it's using the the camera, the repeaters on the sides to kind of visualize the cars next to us. And this is, I think, Tesla getting ready for ultrasonic sensors to be removed because now it's relying on vision to show those uh, representing the cars parked next to us. So reversing over here, it actually stays in this view and if you can see over here, as I reverse, it shows the other cars. They do wobble a little bit. So you can see the car next to us is wobbling a little bit and getting closer. But as I reverse back more and more, it can actually spot all the other cars too. So that's pretty cool. And then when you hit the drive, it kind of goes into a full FSD view. Now, I'm not really sure with other non-FSD enabled vehicles if they do get that view. But uh, what I'm gonna do is that I'm gonna park again and I'm gonna try and disable FSD and see what do I get. Okay, so we found a parking spot and you can see this is a very busy one and we've got lots of cars around us so let's try and disable fsd beta and see what do we get um so here we go autopilot turn it off and then if we hit the reverse button yeah so you don't really see the cars anymore that's true yeah well, actually you do here we go so yeah you don't really see the cars when you are when you are reversing but you do see them when you're going straight forward that's interesting okay so let's try and park again and we'll put FSD back on whoop whoop here we go we go yes and then if you hit the reverse yeah so you really see the cars when you have fsd so that's interesting yeah i never really never really seen that i'm sure this wasn't implemented and i love this bird eye view 360 camera and it's way better than just using the all the other legacy automakers where they where they use um where they use cameras camera footage just to show it because then you see the old weird angles but yeah like you can see this it struggles a little bit because our backup camera is not really but i mean look at the amount of detail this is pretty pretty cool i love it yeah so let me know what you guys think um you know this is a pretty pretty interesting low-key detail that they haven't really spoke about they haven't really spoke about in any of their um update notes so yeah unless i missed it i don't think i did but yeah this uh it's pretty cool so thank you very much for watching and please like and subscribe to my video if you haven't yet it'll help me a lot um yeah, if there's any other easter eggs uh you can tweet at me on my twitter account or drop me a comment and ask me about anything else and i, I can try and find it for you guys but yeah thank you very much and have a nice day